Now that you understand how annotations to drawings are created and linked to other project items, it is very likely that as your project progresses, you will have many annotations and need to view, filter, and locate specific information. The drawings control bar and the filter panel will help you do this. Let's begin by looking at the control bar. The control bar has many useful features to help you organize and manage drawing information. The first icon is Compare. Use this to overlay one drawing with another. Download. You can export a PDF of the drawing view. Search. Enter a search word or number to locate items within the drawing. Comments. See all of the comments pertaining to this drawing. Record information. Additional details regarding this drawing. Layers. Open a filter panel where annotations, links, and comments can be turned on or off. Sharing. Get a link to share this drawing with others who must be active project site users with access to the project. Links. All of the links contained in the drawing will appear in the right panel. To compare drawings, click on the Compare Drawings icon in the upper banner. In the drop-down, you can search for a specific drawing or select a drawing from the list. The two drawings will most likely not overlay exactly one on the other, and you'll have to align them. First, zoom in to a level that clearly shows the misalignment, then click on the Alignment tool and use it to drag the images into alignment. You can fine-tune the alignment using the Nudge panel. When you are finished with the alignment, click Finish Alignment in the upper right. After finishing the alignment, you can click on the Drawing Comparison Gear icon to reveal the drawing comparison options. You can turn on or off either drawing, Click on the Overlap Linework Color icon to open a color picker to change the color. Enable High Contrast or turn on and off annotations. You can go back to adjust the alignment or print the resulting view. The next item in the Drawings Control Panel is the Download option. Click on the Download icon in the upper panel. This will open a download drawing window where you can click on the content field, which will open another window where you can select the content to be downloaded with the drawing. Back on the download drawing window, you can use the switches to select whether to include public annotations or private annotations, as well as include built-ins. The file name will default to the drawing name, but you can edit that here. When you have made your selections, click Download and the file will be sent to your download folder and or your desktop. Next, you can select the search icon in the upper banner, which will open the search panel on the right. Enter a word or sheet number in the search field. The results will immediately appear in the panel and be highlighted in yellow within the drawing. If you click on any one of the results, that item will be highlighted in orange on the drawing. Click on the Comments icon in the upper panel to view and add comments to annotations on the drawing. This will open the Comments panel on the right, displaying all of the comments associated with the annotations on this drawing. You can use the Search field to find a specific comment or sort and filter the comments as needed. Select multiple comments for editing or select any individual comment which will connect and highlight the drawing annotation in the main panel. You can add and post a comment and using the expansion menu add a status to the comment. When you have made your changes click Save. When you click on the Drawing Information icon, the right panel will reveal basic information regarding the selected drawing. This includes whether the drawing is current or obsolete. 
the revision date, and the selected version, which allows you to toggle between different revisions of the drawing. You can also reveal the title, choose the discipline, as well as the location of the drawing. Selections will immediately modify the drawing shown on the main screen. Click on the Layers icon in the upper banner to reveal the Layers filter option, where you can use the switches and drop-downs to control the layers shown on the drawing. Let's look at the switches first, which by default are in the On position to show everything. You can show or hide all annotations. You can show or hide public or private annotations. Use the switches below to show or hide annotation labels linked annotations, unlinked annotations, and show or hide measurements. In addition, or instead of the filter panel switches, you can use the drop-down menus on records and annotations to find and show only the items that you want to see. You can select one or more record types to appear on the drawing. This allows you to show only issue annotations, for instance. When you have made your selections, click Apply. You can select one or more record types and statuses to appear on the drawing. For instance, you can use this filter to show only open issues. You can filter layers on the drawing based on one or more assigned to contacts. You can filter layers on the drawing based on one or more assigned to companies. You can filter layers on the drawing based on one or more annotation types. You can filter layers on the drawing based on one or more annotation colors. You can filter layers on the drawing based on whom the annotation was created by. Use the Reset Filters button to return the panel to its original values. Note that each filter compounds on the previous one so that multiple filters can be used effectively. For instance, once you've selected issues, you can take it a step further and on the status filter, select open to see only open issues. Click on the share icon, which will open a side panel showing the author of the drawing and a URL link to that specific drawing. Click on the copy button to copy the link and paste it into emails or other communication regarding the drawing. Note that only active project site users with access to the project can utilize this shared link. Click on the link icon to open a panel where you can access all items linked to the drawing, organized into files, records, designs, and web links. Click on a link type to reveal all the items of that type. You can click on the item in the panel to highlight its location on the drawing or click the Expand icon to open the item in a new tab or window. Note that public annotations linked to records can be seen by all, but the linked record can only be seen by those who have the permissions to view that record. For example, there is a box that is linked to an RFI. Everyone can see the box. This is a public annotation by default. However, only those who have access to the RFI record can see the link and reference to the RFI.